Hello everyone and welcome back to the Math Puzzle Crash Course. We have a problem here, 3 minus 3 times 6 plus 2 equals. Um, I've done a video on this I think back in July of 2023. Um, kind of wanted to go back through and review it again. I'm seeing lots of mistakes online and forums uh, where people are answering 2 or 17, uh, some cases even minus 17. Uh, but basically, remember your order of operations convention, parentheses, number one, if you have them, uh, you might refer to them as brackets. You have exponents, sometimes referred to as indices or orders. Then you have multiplication and division left to right, then addition and subtraction left to right. But remember, if there are no parentheses or exponents, you start with multiplication or division, solving left to right. And then lastly, you solve addition and subtraction left to right. And I want to get into this addition and subtraction more uh, because really when I say left to right, it doesn't matter. Addition and subtraction have equal precedence. You can do them in any order. But what I run into so many times is people say, well, you're supposed to do addition before subtraction. And then they completely mess up the minus signs and the, the plus signs and they end up with the wrong answer because they're trying to force something that's incorrect. Uh, but anyhow, let's get into this. Uh, first of all, like I said, you do multiplication first. 3 times 16 is 18. Uh, then you do your addition and subtraction, and this is where some people really mess it up. 3 minus 18 plus 2 equals minus 13. So the correct answer to this is minus 13. Uh, another way you can do this is write the multiplication first. It's the same problem. It doesn't matter. 3 minus 3 times 6 plus 2 is the same as minus 3 times 6 plus 3 plus 2, you're still going to get minus 18 plus 3 plus 2 is minus 13. Again, it doesn't matter. Once you get it down to addition and subtraction, it makes no difference what order you do the addition and subtraction. You just have to be sure you're doing the multiplication first. Uh, a lot of people are, are miss, missing the minus sign in front of the 3 times 6. Uh, another method, you can replace all the multiplication with addition. Why is that? Because multiplication is just shorthand for addition. It's shorthand for repeated addition. That's all it is. So if it bothers you that you have multiplication and you want to go left or right, well, replace it. Um, 3 times 6 is the same thing as 6 plus 6 plus 6, which you see in the second line. So it's 3 minus, now you got to get your minus signs correct, it's minus the quantity of 6 plus 6 plus 6. So it's 3 minus 6 minus 6 minus 6 plus 2 still equals minus 13. So if, uh, if that's confusing, you can always pause the video and think that one over, but you can always replace multiplication with addition. Um, as I already stated, multiplication is repeated addition. Uh, division is multiplication by a reciprocal. Um, exponents are repeated multiplication. Parentheses are grouping symbols that just tell us to resolve operations inside of those parentheses uh, before solving those outside of the parentheses. Uh, and the order of operations convention is not arbitrary. It makes perfect sense. It's, it's been taught forever. Unfortunately, a lot of people do forget uh, over time. Now, this is a, a really interesting response that I just got um, in, a, in a forum here um, in the last day. And it's from someone who's claiming to be a 17-year-old kid in college. And I get making mistakes, but um, this one here really really shows some of the issues here. You got, so they, I, I, I deleted their name. I'm not looking to humiliate anybody here, but 3 minus 3 times 6 plus 2. Okay, they're doing this right so far, 3 minus 18 plus 2. But here's where they go off the rails. They're saying 15 plus 2 is 17. Somehow they're saying 3 minus 18. If I have $3 and on my credit card or my debit card and I go to the store and I charge $18, do I magically now have $15? No, I'm in debt $15. 3 minus 18 is minus 15. So they should have written minus 15 plus 2, which would give you minus 13. So I think a lot of people are getting 17 as an answer because they're messing that up. Uh, but they go on to talk about BIDMAS, which, yeah, there is an acronym called BIDMAS, brackets, indices, division, multiplication, addition, and subtraction. 
Uh, and they're saying, well, basic math taught in year seven, or for those who don't know the British schooling system, 11 to 12 years old. This is coming from a 17-year-old who's in college. It's kind of sad to see that people don't know this. I know it used to be Bodmus, but it's still the same thing. Well, I believe Bodmus might still be taught. I know there's other acronyms. I don't get hung up on the acronyms. The acronyms are are misleading. I've got other videos on those. There's Bodmus, there's PEMDAS. You could call it PEDMAS. You could call, there's BEDMAS. I think brackets, exponents, division, multiplication, addition, subtraction. There's BIDMAS. Um, uh, I think in German they refer to, uh, uh, it's translated, I believe, to point before line, but it's Punkt vor Strich. Uh, that's a different, you know, it's still all the same order of operations. There's four steps. Um, but where people get hung up is they memorize the order of six letters. Some people will say, well, BODMAS gives you a different answer than PEMDAS because the D comes before the M, uh, which is completely ridiculous. A lot of people assume that these are six-step checklists when they're, in fact, they all represent the same four steps of the order of operations. So just keep in mind that you got parentheses and exponents, but multiplication and division have equal precedence. And then your fourth step, you have addition and subtraction. And again, subtraction is just the addition of a negative number. So it's the same thing. They have the same precedence. You can work them left to right, backwards, forwards, addition, subtraction. doesn't matter what order you do them in. So um, I just wanted to highlight this one answer because I think this is what's happening with a lot of people getting 17. Now, another common wrong answer is people getting uh, the answer of 2. Those people getting two are doing this. Well, this is what you need to get to. This would be correct to get two. Three minus three in parentheses is what? Zero, right? Three minus three is zero. Zero times six is zero. And then zero plus two would be two. But a lot of people that are answering 2 are assuming that you do the 3 minus 3 uh, before the multiplication, which again is incorrect. So the two most common wrong answers I'm seeing are 17 and 2. Uh, so I hope this has been helpful. And uh, if you like the video, please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.